think you've just lost your most valuable piece. But winning strategy sometimes necessitates sacrifice. War has been averted. Mm. Well, I disagree. How so? Didn't you find it strange that the telegram you sent didn't inspire any action to stop me? You see, hidden within the unconscious is an insatiable desire for conflict. So you're not fighting me so much as you are the human condition. All I want to do is own the bullets and the bandages. War on an industrial scale is inevitable. They'll do it themselves within a few years. All I have to do is wait. I like Switzerland. They respect a man's privacy here. Particularly if he has a fortune. Bishop takes night to check. The game is over. You should get that shoulder looked at. About that fortune of yours, I believe it's just been substantially Reduced. King de Rook too. I attended several of your lectures. The equations of motion, which you will find in my book, the energy that is required to release this explosion is... It was in actually... Oslo when I first caught a glimpse of your little notebook, red leather bound from Smythes in a Bond Street. Rook to King's Rook three. Check. Bishop to Rook three. Its importance was not fully apparent to me until I observed your penchant for feeding pigeons. But then it occurred that with an empire so enormous, even you must keep a record of it somewhere. Bishop takes Bishop. Rook to Bishop four. I then only required the notebook itself. You didn't make it easy. What will I go, monsieur? Just the bags. I would need to endure a considerable amount of pain. Uh, my God, <laughs> kill Her Majesty's secret service. But the notebook would undoubtedly be encoded, so how then to break the code? Rook takes rook. Pawn takes rook. Bishop to bishop seven. Queen takes knight pawn. Does the art of domestic horticulture mean anything to you? How could a man as meticulous as you own such a book you completely neglect the flowers in his own window box? Irony abounds. Never mind, it's safe. In London. Where my colleagues are making good use of it. The most formidable criminal mind in Europe has just had all his money stolen by perhaps the most inept inspector in the history of Scotland Yard. Any chance of a cup of tea? Box 0403. Tick. Box 0801. How much more is there? That's the end of page two. Page three. He'll be making an anonymous donation to the Widows and Orphans of War Fund. Bishop to Bishop 8. Discover check. And incidentally, mate. <laughs>